Hello and welcome to some USF 2000 at Alton Park. We are at the Island Historic layout, which uh, <laughs> there's like six different layouts for Alton Park, so I'm never even quite sure which one we're at until I get here, but uh, you'll see when we come around here. We've got the heavy braking zone. Let me, uh, let me do something real quick. I was practicing with this at 51.1. Oh, I always like doing that to lower the chance to lock up my brakes. I don't even know if that's a thing or not, if that actually is helping. But it's what I practiced with, so that's what I'm going to keep for now. But um, this car is so much fun. Uh, I just I need to race it more often. It doesn't have the greatest participation in the series. We get about 20 people signed up to this one. I'm not sure how many people are actually in here in the lobby. I didn't look. but. Uh, always have a great time running this thing and trying not to crash as I, I still am pretty light on uh, open wheel experience so there's a lot of uh, beginner mistakes I'm liable to make but I am familiar with Alton Park even though there are about a hundred different layouts <laughs> so hopefully uh, that'll help me out and this one today, and I can have a good run. Okay, you come to third time lap. But for now, we're doing some qualifying. Gonna take it a little easier the first lap. Just making sure I can get around the track, and then I'll push a little bit more the next one. Kinda just seems like the way to go. That time I got some push. Quite all that fast. Here's the big braking zone. My uh, best was a 115.1. I have not been able to replicate that with any consistency, however. I must have, I don't know if I had draft, I wasn't paying attention at the time. I probably had draft or something I was leeching off of to get that time, but. Have been able to get. Consistently about a half second slower than that. I'm feeling okay. I'm um, just going to try to keep it on track and have a fun race just driving this thing around. Because that is always a good time. So, we'll push a little harder this lap. Obviously, I don't expect to hit my best with a heavier fuel load. This car gets much faster as time goes on in the race. So just for the couple of laps of qualifying, it's unreasonable to expect the best times unless, I don't know, you're better than me or something. <laughs> I got a lot of push out of that corner again. I must be overdriving it. You can get some decent time by being a little bit aggressive on the, th uh, well not aggressive necessarily, but getting on the throttle kind of gently through the middle of that corner. and uh, being more aggressive on the exit, but you just can't overdo it or else you'll start uh, getting the oversteer. Ugh. Hey, I cannot get that corner very consistently. I think I mess that corner up about every time I take it. <laughs> Here's another corner where uh, you can get a little bit loose if you start getting on the throttle too hard, but... Alright, I'll take that. 115.9. Okay. That'll bring us to P2. For now. Obviously, uh, probably most people's second lap's gonna be faster, so we could drop a couple more spots here in a moment. But... I'll take it. That's about where I'm running. I, want, I just wanted to kind of get it in the 15s. And I'm happy with that. So, still about three minutes. We'll go, uh, we'll race out here. Peter Dempsey having some serious trouble with the internet. That stinks. I don't know the guy, but it still stinks. You don't want anybody to have troubles like that. 
we'll just get some extra practice in here before we head out and see if I can learn anything. Hey, that was pretty good. I just, I need to get that set of corners more consistent. I mess that set of corners up more often than I hit it. Hey, and look at that. Got through the final corner better than I ever have. So every lap it feels like I learn something new in this series every time I come out here and race it, so. You can easily get an off track there if you're not careful. So you kind of have to ride that edge of pushing hard through there but not giving yourself an off track every lap because that stuff adds up, believe it or not. Hopefully it's going to be a fun race. I would, uh, you know, all I really want is to get some laps in, have some good side-by-side -side maybe, or even if I'm just uh, all on my own, just racing this car is some pretty good fun. Down to third. Oh, there's the number one hitting better than my uh, all-time best. See, if you're better than me, you can hit that any time you want. <laughs> and on, like, qualifying laps. Draft is a pretty big thing, though, in these cars. Very, very uh, aerodynamic, so... We'll see if we can keep up with guys who might even be a little bit faster and maybe help us be faster. Maybe not even need to pass them, but just uh, learn something from them, you know? Shouldn't be too much longer now. One minute. The hope is that everybody's ready, but I think with that guy losing his internet connection, I don't know if he ever rejoined, so we probably will have to wait the whole minute anyway. I could probably be more aggressive in that braking zone, but I am a big scaredy cat, so... <laughs> Maybe if I uh, practice in, the, uh, in an open practice session. Again, sometime in the future, that'll be when I start trying all that stuff out, but I'm just going to start crashing my car and racking up at incident points if I start doing it here. Feeling good, though. It feels like I can probably keep it on track. Even if I'm trying not to, it's like in that corner. I just didn't slow it down enough right there. That's all that was. Alright. Hey, that was good timing. I was just about to slow it down. Fortunately, the two still not here. It looks like. So, that poor guy's gonna miss the start. We will start P3 as the number three. Oh, hey, look, the number one guy got a, t a bit even better time next time through. So, that's a guy to learn from. And we got race labs up here. One to go. Next time Take a look, we've got a couple of uh, fellow A drivers, this guy A2.0, and then uh, D drivers. So you basically got A drivers or D drivers. <laughs> Nothing in between, apparently. That's interesting. Oh, there's a C driver. Peter back there. But we'll see how... Uh, how it goes. Hopefully guys are not too aggressive from the start. Just let things settle down a little bit before they start going, but I also know better than to expect that. <laughs> you can hope for it, but don't expect it. You do get pace laps in this car, but we are halfway through the lap already, so that's cool. Get a drink of water right before we start here. So that way, my voice doesn't go out. <laughs> we'll be following the one, getting a jump whenever he decides. Johannes Belitz, I guess maybe is how you would pronounce his name. Good luck to him and everybody else. I said to myself, when nobody could hear me. Oops. Just realized I had one of my speakers pointed directly at the microphone. So that wasn't making it sound awful. Fixed it. <laughs> Try not to have my micro my uh, speakers pointing right at the microphone because I don't use headphones. 
It's just uncomfortable. He's off. I don't want to pass this guy. Uh, is that a... Hope that's not a black flag. I didn't want to pass the guy before the start anyway, because that's kind of cheap. Even if he's going to wreck! Oh, boy. Alrighty then. Yeah, we hadn't gotten the green yet, so I didn't necessarily want to be... passing that guy. Even if I could have gotten away with it, it just felt kind of cheap. Stop some car ride. Clear on the right. Car ride. You're on the left. Rewind. Clear. Sorry, guys. My bad. Myers. Your rear wing is damaged. <sighs> Check the damage. Make sure this thing's turning. Jesus Christ, dude. Oh my god, why would you put it that close? Everybody is pretty much wrecked. This thing does not feel quite right, but I'm going to stay out if I don't have a meatball flag. It's definitely feeling unsettled all of a sudden, but I'm just going to try to manage it. It's feeling like I'm going to have to be extra careful on throttle with my injured race car. He apologized. It's not a very great move by him, but clearly he didn't mean to do it, so I'm not going to be all angry. I'm just going to take what I have now and try to move on. But he is able to slow it down this time. I wonder how many people got taken out by that. Could have been worse. We uh, kept moving, and we don't have a meatball flag. Hanging on with these guys. Well, we are, for now. Not going to if I uh, blow the corners like that. We got blocking. That's pretty ugly. Why are we blocking for second place? I'm just gonna be patient. The leader has just done a 115. Leader's gone. Unless he wrecks, no one's got a chance at him. He avoided uh, Dive Bomb Johnson, Esquire, on lap one. I don't actually know if he tried a dive bomb or if he just missed the braking zone. I don't. I didn't see exactly what happened, but. I like giving people funny names. <laughs> Car definitely feels strange through the corners. This guy's going very slow through here. Getting me unsettled. I do not want to get caught by the seven back there. God. Did the guy make another error? Sounded like something bad happened. This isn't the worst thing in the world. It feels like it's a little oversteer happy, but it's not unmanageable. So I'm just gonna be a little bit extra careful, even if I was already being careful, and just try to get this thing to the end. Real slow through here. Nothing I can do about that. Oh my goodness. Dropping the anchor. <laughs> I wonder what my car looks like with the rear wheel, uh, the rear wing damaged, rather. Still ten minutes to go. Find 
Oh wow, now it says seven seconds behind? He was like six seconds a moment ago. Maybe the timing's not completely accurate here. Okay, Colton, ten minutes to go. That's ten minutes. These guys are a little faster in some sections than I am, and I think I got them bested in a couple other sections as they lock up the tires. I don't know if I necessarily want to be in front of them so they can run into the back of me and I can get taken out for the second time in the race. Especially if they, uh, well, we saw some blocking already, which was concerning. This guy breaks a little bit more than I like to here. I have to kind of anticipate that. Guy in second got pretty slow there. They're going to have to break earlier. He's just going to stop. <laughs> that is... What is this guy doing? He's just absolutely slamming on the brakes. Just blocking everybody. I think I'm just going to wait for these guys to maybe make a mistake. I have the feeling one of these two drivers, if not both, will not make it to the end. Maybe I'm the one not making it to the end. We're gonna find out. Ooh, getting a little bit of push. See, maybe it's me. Maybe I'm the one not making it to the end. But I got that feeling that the wrecking is not over. Gosh, this thing is not turning. It was kind of oversteering at first, and now it feels like it's understeering. The actor Lewis in front is now 1.0. I better just focus on what I'm doing and quit worrying about passing people I'm not even keeping up with at the moment. Because they look like they have uh, all of a sudden started going faster. Still fun to drive even though it's <laughs> broken. A little bit more fun whenever you're uh, heading top speed, but... That's okay. We are, uh, in the position we're in now, we're about to lose two I rating. So maybe I can gain one more spot before the end of this okay, thing. Oh! Your Your fuel is fine. And, uh, prevent a loss. But that, no, no, that never matters. That doesn't matter at all. <laughs> It's not like you can spend it anywhere. Can you imagine how terrible that would be? Like, yeah, I spent a uh, thousand I rating on a uh, a pack of three fast repairs. God, can you imagine if they monetized I racing like that? I think everybody would leave immediately. Find me on NASCAR Heat. <laughs> Got a little bit excited on the throttle there. No need for that. Oh, these guys have settled down a little bit ahead of me, I think. At least at the moment, they don't look like they're going to crash. Got through there better than both of them that time. Keep searching, you'll find a gap. What is blocking? That's so bad. That's why you gotta do that. And the nine gets around him for now. He's going back around though. Oh my god, they're trying to hit wheels on the straightaway for no reason. What are we doing? I don't wanna be around these guys. Come on, figure it out. I want no part of whatever they're doing here. Broadham has just been disqualified. Someone's disqualified. Not sure who that was. No one I see around me, I don't like. 
this isn't gonna work. Oh, okay. I thought they were going through there side by side. That was never working in any universe. So. Glad that they uh, decided against it. Mm-hmm. Going for the pass, I see. Okay. Whoa, I'm taking you three wide, look out. Is that crashing? Oh my gosh. It's scary, but it's still pretty fun watching these guys go crazy. Just a couple laps to go. Okay, this guy just completely parks it in front of me. There's just there's nothing I can do here. These two guys are forming the brickiest brick wall that have, has ever existed. Can't race this. It's just not giving room. I'm just gonna crash if I try to race this guy. Blocking garbage is just <sighs> suck. That's two minutes left, two minutes. I mean, <sighs> there's no respect for anybody out here coming f 10 miles an hour faster than he is because he babies it through the corner. And so I wreck trying to not to run at the back of him. You're welcome. Guy fails to pass the guy ahead of him for the entire race, and then he just starts losing time, so I'm like, alright, well, I guess I'll pass him. And then he wants to block me after I waited the entire race for them to sort their stupidity out. Like, you just got the white flag. That means one more lap to go. Okay, that's cool. All right, Colton, I'm just frustrated right now. I'm not even in it anymore. White flag, one more to go. That guy can eat a brick. What's up top of bricks here? He is a brick wall. 
brickiest brick wall, and he needs to eat a brick. So you would think we're at Indy, the way I'm talking. Just two minutes left, and two minutes to go. And I guess we still got a top five, but I think I was at, I was at least second fastest in this race. But there's just nothing I can do. I mean, I guess I don't know who got taken out in that first wreck. I got damage in the first wreck, but still think I was the second fastest out here. Well, we still end up fourth. So. Hopefully that guy feels ashamed. I doubt it, though. Okay, we're done. Chicken flag, chicken guy flag. who decides to block and wreck me. <sighs> One still here. Just give him a good win. Not gonna get a good race, though. Because I didn't really even get to do it. <laughs> Somehow I was the one that got taken out. Go figure. Like I was saying, it was me all along, the one that gets taken out. Oh, so we'll take a look. See what else happened. See that first lap wreck. We got first corner wreck right here. That's uh, this guy from a million miles back. That guy leaves without apologizing, so that's really cool of him. He just way overdrives his braking zone. I brake right about here. He brakes like past this little hill. <gasps> Excuse me. And, uh,. Well, it doesn't even matter where your reg regular braking zone is. You still have to slow down for the people in front of you, especially on the first lap. And he failed to do that. So we got rear wing damage. Doesn't look visible, but we obviously knew we had it. Because uh, it was a struggle for a little bit. Me trying to get used to it. Of course, me getting used to my rear wing and how it feels learning about the new understeer I'm experiencing at this point in the run. That's what lets Bingo on a bias. Some grass right there. I wonder if you got damage from that. So... That guy locks it up, like, he's just driving terrible the whole time, and I'm just afraid to even get near them. And then as soon as I do get near them, he blocks me and wrecks me. And then, then this was at the very end. There we get the pass for P4 again. So we didn't actually see what it looked like. Just locking it up. And he's just got no speed through this corner. It's like, what are you doing? It's, I have to stab on the brakes, and that's what happens when you stab on the brakes in this car. Like, he knows that he completely blew this corner after blowing the last corner and the majority of the other previous corners. 
It goes through here at zero miles an hour. Like, I am a good... He's 101, I'm 107. We're like, we're a good six miles an hour faster than he is. Like, I don't know, am I supposed to just plow into the back of him next time? Is that what he wants? No, this is exactly what he wanted. Why would he do it any differently? It worked out for him. So, that sucks. But, I mean, we still pulled it into P4, I guess. Um, Could have been better. But, that's fine. We'll <laughs> lose our massive loss of 2 of I rating. <laughs> I care more about the safety rating than that, which will probably take a loss, but... At the end of the day, that doesn't matter either. The only guy without incidents is the guy that didn't show up. So, four of mine came from, actually, four of mine came from the six, or not the six, the uh, four, and then the other three came from spinning out and getting an off track from the nine. So I would have been at zero, but oh, whatever. Enough complaining. <laughs> That'll do it. Uh, still fun to drive these cars, even when they're injured. And even when you got people blocking. So, uh, I'll be back again sometime anyway. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.